Hey YouTube, welcome to the second day of the Halloween event. Uh, we had a daily to turn in a cat figurine. I did it. We now have our fourth pistol case uh, and another 7,000 XP. It wants us to leave reserve three times. We get a suppressor, a rig, and more importantly, 7,000 XP for doing that. Maybe that's something we talk about. And then I believe we have yeah, a find and transfer here, one survival lighter, one zippo. That should be pretty easy to get on reserve with the filing cabinets. Another 5,500 XP. We could replace it for another trader's rep, but you know what? I think the experience is worth more to me right now. Because we are currently 60k away from 38. I think we can make that today. Um, we're only go I'm only going to be live for a few hours, but we'll see. We'll see. Because can you can you get the COD FM, the COD FM radio in the light in the light lighthouse loot room? Can you make them? You can make them at Intel Seven in Intel Center Level Two, but that requires Med Station Three, which we're never going to get. Okay, interesting. Oh, uh, oh, perfect spawn. Okay, chat. Um, we haven't been out there yet. Oh, oh, we should check what is our debuff from the Halloween events. We lose energy. That's pretty standard. We got a bit of a hand tremor for a few seconds, and we're smarter. We're smarter than the average bear. Okay, I'm going to hit up the stash, and then I think we'll go for the lighthouse. Screw it. Why not? Give it a shot. Something different. Just drink 80% lemon juice, exactly, just like you, and you'll have the power to crunch knees. For those of you watching non-live, uh, one of our community members, Knee Cruncher, as he goes, uh, decided to consume 80% proof lemon juice, and uh, his insides turned inside, and he's he seems to be okay now, though. Flashbangs with NVGs or pineapple juice straight to the ocular nerve? Yeah. Yeah. Mm, yeah, mm, I guess. Uh, wouldn't it help, really? Like, I mean, sure, you'd still get the flash in your eyes, but it's being filtered through a, a screen, right? I, I mean, this I've never worn NVGs in my life, so I, I actually have no idea. I imagine you'd get the flash, but you wouldn't have the same sort of blinding effect? Well, he's not as severe. Surely it would, like, mitigate it a bit, because you're just kind of seeing a, a projection. Hey, by the way, you don't want to play the next season on the London servers because more players means more content. Um, I would love to, Rivo. The issue there's two issues with that. One, the service is it's paid, so it's it's seven bucks a month, which isn't that much to be honest. I'm um, considering what it offers. the The other reason is that the ping is really high. So, I'm I mean I'm bad at PvP when I don't have a ping disadvantage. Can you imagine if I um, if I'm the the laggiest person on the server every single time? It does make me a little worried. What I will say about this, though, is the London server thing. I will be playing on it a lot more often now that it is an option. Um, because I will be I will be getting and keeping that subscription going whenever I'm running an active series. Yeah, we might get sniped, Chip, but you know what? I think it's worth a shot just for just to. Tr oh, well, we probably needed a sidearm anyway. I think it's worth a try. Let's just see if we um let's see if we can make anything of it. We're gonna have to run this in stages though. My stamina is not great. If anyone's up there, I can't see him. What subscription? This is the subscription for the software I use. To, uh, to get me to the London servers. It's a software called Exit Lag. Um, Exit Lag. And it, it basically, it digs a tunnel through the internet from your router to the server you're trying to connect to in a straight line. And it can shave 10, 15% off your ping, which for me is just enough to get me into UK. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> that got me. <laughs> oh, it's just enough to get me into the UK. Oh, that got me good. Woo! Because I was just thinking, my head's very blue. Woo! That was well-timed. Well played, sir. Well played. That was a very good ricochet. Okay, yeah, we're going to have to shoot here, because there will be scavs, and that's going to tell everyone we're here, and we're going to get sniped on the way out. But I kind of... I haven't. I don't think I've been here this hardcore series, so it'll be fun to, to check it out. I'd like this give us a backpack. Probably going to leave it behind, though. Uh, 
Ah, there is a weapon crate there. I, I see, I miss. Okay. Give me a suppressor for this gun. Oh, I need two things. I need the thread adapter and then the suppressor. But you know, a girl can dream. Is this SMB? It's SMB! Holy shit! Pretty good! Pretty, pretty good! That was, uh, oh, got me good. Oh, so in the previous Halloween event, if you ate one unit of sugar, it would give you all the buffs. So use one, and it would give you the buffs for five minutes. No, no, it's only for a few seconds now. Max stamina plus 10? Holy shit. How much do you dehydrate? Nothing? No dehydration on the sugar? Bro, when we run back, we're gonna sugar it up, let me tell ya. I get every- ah, uh, let's- hold on. Hold on. Okay, so you... You don't give any energy? Nothing gives any energy? Oh, fuck. Okay, that still gives hydration, at least. Oh shit, chat. We're gonna die. Please rectify your Thank you, Rybo. We're gonna die. What am I doing? Running in circles? Aim it. Aim. Does he live? He lives. Remember they cracked? Got him. What? I hit you in the head. No, there's two. Ah! Oh, that was a sound effect, wasn't it? Yeah. Of course it was. He's dead too. Okay. Good shots. Hey, do you give energy? Something here has to give me energy or I'm dead. Okay, everyone here now knows we're here. Energy plus 75. Okay, we'll wait till the last second and we can we can juice it up to get out of this hole. Got the dang. What do we got here? Bitcoin? Ooh. I think we need one more, boys. One more of those and we've got the uh, weapon box. Do you give stamina? You, I mean energy, sorry. Yes, you do. Okay, excellent. So, oh, we'll need that too. All the food, all the food are belong to us. Get out of here. Heavy. Don't like you. Okay. Hey, Badass Beast, welcome to the stream, buddy. Why did you change the posture? Because uh, a friend of mine told me that shouting at myself every day on stream was starting to make me flinch whenever I heard it. And I looked back at the footage and he's completely right. And I was like, you know what? A little bit of self-love goes a long way. So uh, we, we now kindly request posture changes instead of demanding them at gunpoint. It's all about improving. <laughs> nice emojis, Vanas. I'm glad to see you got your membership. Oh, please don't tell me. Oh, God. it's the Isn't that the key we've been looking for? I think it's the one I got Matt to... No, no. We got Matt to buy 216. Okay. My, my conscience remains absolved. Okay, where does things spawn, chat? I've never been in here. Uh, we got a golden pig. No, it's just rotten. Never mind. This room is shit. What the hell? But that's why it was amazing. Yeah, well, I, I get the I get the whole meme. Oh, let's watch the bald man hurt himself on stream. But like, it's not actually healthy long term. So we're gonna we we're, we're revising the the methodology and we're 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 embracing self love and dedication. Okay, and we're all gonna go on this journey together. We're going to become a wholesome family streamer. Chat, does nothing spawn in this god-awful place? Bro. Bro. Bruh. Bruh moment. Sugar spawn rates are off the scale. I believe it. Look high up for a medical crate. I see it. We're fucked. Yeah, this is a bit goofy. This is, this is a bit goofy. This is a little bit, this is a little bit, this is a little bit lame. Take some painkillers though. That's kind of kind of sick with it. Um. Okay. So the lighthouse marked room is not worth the journey. Is all I will say about it. Yes. I mean, maybe we just get un maybe we just got really unlucky. Maybe I don't know where to look. Heck, just do one last pass. 
Make sure we're not complete. Is that Obama? No. <laughs> it is not Obama. Oh, God. Also, hi to all the new viewers in chat. Welcome to the stream. If you haven't been here before, this is a game called Escape from Tarkov. It's, um, it's, it's a game that tries... The core design philosophy is that a rhinoceros is standing on your genitals and kind of twisting its foot a little bit. Uh, and then what we do is we take that idea and we, we, we stretch it a little bit further, right? We say, what if the rhinoceros also was wearing soccer cleats? And uh, he's got the really long spiky ones too. And uh, that's just kind of what we're up to today. So uh, welcome to the stream. <laughs> The key has 40 durability. I think it's down to 10. Yeah, it's down to 10 again now, Ni. Nee. Have a look. It's on 10 now. They've changed it. They try to make it seem like a real key. Also, this is the fourth of these that we've received, which I think is very funny, considering Pestily looked for it for like six years. What a year. Okay, so there's a scavs outside. Don't get it twisted. You will be fighting on the way out. I think I'm gonna... I think I'm gonna... Ooh, that's... Ooh. <laughs> Baby, suddenly things are looking a little better for old largely, huh? Pop that bad boy up. And the rhino is shouting at you in Russian in your own voice. Yes, yes, this is yes. That is that is yes. Have I played this again? Provide me chat. Okay, that was worth checking. Crazy boys. Bastard. Don't snipe me from behind, motherfucker. See you all. I know you're lucky. Okay, so we killed one there. We killed one there. You have this. We're loud either way. Although we do need to get bolt action training, so... Uh, where am I going? Water. Oh, thank you, Rivo. You're quite right. Ah. Uh, they really don't want that room to be good, dude. They are doing everything in their power to make it suck. Heard him. A while ago. Put that on full auto. They do go in this little building sometimes. Just clear. Am I wearing armor? I'm not. Okay, keep that in mind, boys. Keep that in mind. Uh, let's do this before we get dehydrated in the middle of combat. Not that I'd call- oh, oh, he's just drinking the whole can? What a monster. How long does this event go for? It'll probably go till Sunday, Rivo. That's how they usually do it. You don't give- you just make me search faster for a little bit. You make me run further. You give me hydration, yes. Yeah. Okay, cool. We're looking okay. We're looking okay. Um, I might as well just drink these up then. Give me five minutes of better searching and running. Oh, we'll, we'll use the kvass when we leave, I guess. I don't want to min-max it too much, but that does make sense. Uh, put that up there. Okay. Cool. There is a scab, boys, don't forget. Because I already have. Found him. He's a ghost? He's down. There we go. The only is he the only one though? Nope. One on the left. Let's approach him from this side, I think. Uh, oh, let's do this. Be smart about this. We have the bullets. He does not have arm. Wait for him to walk right. He's moving left. Get a nice high angle here. There he is. Do 
He went behind the carpet. I don't know if... Oh, there. He's running towards me now. Oh, he's behind the... He's behind the bricks. Cool. Alright, and let's loot these scabs. They usually spawn in pairs. They might be three, though. Buzz and a shotgun. We'll leave that behind. That was the Tuz guy. Uh, where did the other ones die? Over here, over there, over there. Okay. Oh, I mean, it's armor. Not great armor, but it is armor. Oh, I didn't get this guy. Okay, I guess that wasn't a headshot. I got him over here then. to deal with a Karen? Or did they get driven out of SA, Switzerland and Korea? Um, I've dealt with many Karens in my short life. Uh, I, my, my job in many ways was dealing with Karens as a teacher. Uh, and it was hell. I'll be honest. Karens suck. Uh, my, what's, my, what's my worst Karen story? Let me think. Let me think. Oh, this is really bad loot to be this heavy with. We killed another one, chat. Where is he? This guy, that guy. Ah. Alright, well the loot up there is dog shit, so we're just gonna leave. And this guy. That everybody, okay. Cool. Alright, kvass me. We're making the run. Um, what's my worst Karen story? I think the worst one was there was this one teacher. Oh, sorry, this one parent. Who... He would come into the school every single day. And she would just scream. At the teachers, at the students, at everyone, for being like not good enough at their jobs, for being like bad sportsmen at the sports day, um, for not giving her kid perfect grades when he literally spends the entire day eating glue. Um, sometimes he flavors it with crayons. That that woman sucked, man. Um, and she could speak English fluently. She'd grown she'd grown up in Toronto, uh, and she refused to speak it to me. She would only speak Korean and. My Korean's not great now, but back then it was much worse, um, at that point, and, like, almost nothing. And so I would kind of just sit there and be screamed at in another language, very similar to this experience. So this, and if anything, it was training for Tarkov. Uh, and, and I would just kind of, like, sit there and hold my hands and be like, okay, yep, okay, nah, nah, miannyo, miannyo, sanjangnim, sanjangnim, miannyo, miannyo. By the way, thank you very much for the five bucks, said it, appreciate it very much. Why use all the sugar? Leave one cube. Why? For what, my brother in Christ? I can't use the flea market, remember? I can't make moonshine. I don't have a moonshine case. Um, I understand the min-maxing, the sweaty Tarkov, but have you considered having fun in the games you play? <laughs> I know it's a it's a rare it's a rare habit among Tarkov enjoyers, but it is it is it is okay to just kinda play a game, you know, and then like that's all you do with it. Barter for bags, I guess? What bag barter uses sugar? I didn't know about that one. I, I suddenly feel like a fool for berating this man. Oh, mods, could someone nuke it? Thank you, Ryvo. Appreciate you. The sex bot has been punched. Weird you always have so many Canadians in your stream, too. I think it's just the morning time, man. I think it's just the morning time. But yeah, we got a lot of people from Central and Northern Europe. And, uh, and a lot of people from Canada. And elsewhere in North America. Even had a Mexican dude. We had a Puerto Rican dude a while back. That was fun. Pretty nice guy, actually. Him and his brother watched the streams together, which I think is so cute. I think his younger brother. When I see his username, I, uh, it, things get family friendly real quick. Eastern Europe, baby! Yeah, oh, we got the whole map, man. But for a very small channel, there's a wide demographic. Which, I think, is a very good sign for the future. Simply because it means that I'm un people in multiple areas can understand me. Um, 
And that, I think that's a big barrier to entry that some other YouTubers have, is that they're, they're amazing content creators, amazing people, they've got great ideas, but the language barrier is there. Um, and it's not there as much for me, maybe. I hope, anyway. Come on, England! Walk it in, boys! Something like that. You need one for the attack two butter. Okay, cool. Noted. I will start holding on to one use sugars in the future. I think I also need like souries and liquors bars and stuff, but I, I've got, probably got those by now. Then gives you a fleur. Yeah, hey, knee cruncher. Here yeah, with the knowledge. All right. Leaving them back with more ammo than we came and uh, a bunch of really mid loot. Um, uh, let's let's get out so we can refresh our hydration. But uh, yeah, I, I mean, we probably I would have liked to go up to the loot house as well. Okay, not just kind of a, just a, that was just like a warm up exploration raid, I guess. We did what we did. Uh, yeah, that's okay. And XP is uh, XP is adequate. My sister is a uh, she calls herself a ranger. Which to me feels like a right on the edge of being like a hardline racial slur. Um, so uh, I don't really call ginger people rangers. Uh, sh she is herself ginger, like very ginger. Um, it does cost certain doubts on the lineage, um, as many people have pointed out. Thanks for that, by the way. The, the nightmares never leave me. Okay, H how many? How many? How many more? Because a weapons case would go pretty far. Not like a million rubles does anything for us. We can get a weapons case. Okay, hold on. Thumbnail. We got it. Can I get some pogs? Can I get some pogs? Sister unemployed is also bald. <laughs> new lore. New lore just... Wake up, babe. New lore just dropped. Okay, get rid of this shit armor. Thank you for the pogs, Rob. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Oh, baby. Look at the pogs flowing. My sister has hair, dude. So like I know I know it's a common misunderstanding among laymen that bald people are like dwarves in Lord of the Rings, um, or rather in like the book version of Lord of the Rings, not whatever they put on screen. Rings of Power. Uh, I actually like the Rings of Power for the record. Anyway, we'll talk about that later. Bald people can have relatives with hair. I don't want to be. I don't want to say I'm the first one to say it. But I'm certainly the loudest, and that makes me right. Okay, get the mechanic, get the barter. Heal. Thought I was gonna tell me it's out of uh, it's out of stock. No, we're all good. We're all Gucci. Put this away, oh, baby. Here we freaking go. All right, I do need to still compact because we have more mag space. We have more mag box space than we have gun space. But this is gonna I'm just gonna put a little dent. I'm gonna put a little dent in the old storage. You love to see it. Uh, let's get all the five slot ones in there. That looks good. Okay, now what else fits? That fits. That fits. These are all a little smaller. A little smaller with it. Put that. Put that. Ugh, this is looking gross. Oh, I hate this. Hold on. Hold on. I ha Wait, I hate it. I hate it so much. No, we got it all in there. Okay, we got it all in in the end. Um, uh, looking fine. Looking fly. You're millennial in the same way I'm Gen Z, kind of. Exactly. Like, we're on the cusp. We're on the cusp of millenniality. Hater, you and I. But uh, I think that there is also a... Uh, like, I'm, am I no, I'm in a weird space because I hate corporate America, but I also can use TikTok. So, it's... <laughs> so, exactly. I'm trapped in this liminal space of nonsense and, and uncertainty. And honestly, it'd be very nice if they could just come up with like a, like a gen me, and then I can be the special boy. It is Scorpio season after all. I'm not a Scorpio. I don't believe in astrology, just for the record. It's just really funny when you say shit like that because it's just insane. I remember most of the 80s, but I also used email in my teens. Exactly. So like, I grew up before smartphones. I got, my, I got the first smartphone. My first smartphone was the Samsung S2 in 2017, in 2011, sorry. And that was like revolutionary. It was like an Android phone that could do things. And it was like, whoa, oh my God, a smartphone. And I remember, I remember that being like new technology. And now it's just everywhere. It's only been like 11 years. God, I'm old. I'm bleeding. 
Excuse me? Sir? Bloody rude. Okay, I got strength from my blood. Did I go to shoreline, chat? I did go to shoreline. Fuck, <laughs> I didn't mean to go to shoreline. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Alright, well, well, hold on. Can we, can we do anything here? I genuinely didn't mean to come here. I gotta kill scavs. Whoops. Uh, that's in the health resort. Well, you know, I've been meaning to die. I didn't mean to come here. That's a big goof. Uh, I'm just gonna check the jackets and reset. I wanna do reserve and lighthouse today exclusively, I think. I don't have much time to stream, so I'd like to make them count. Oh my god, you don't believe in astrology? No, I don't. I'm sorry. Sorry to burst your bubble. I know that I know that your opinion of me hinges around my um, uh, astronomical beliefs, but uh, and I have to be the one to pull the umbilical on that. That's not a phrase, by the way, for those of you whose English is not the first language. Uh, but clearly, it's not mine either. Uh, you do not pull an umbilical cord out of anything. It's not an idiom. Please don't repeat that in public and then tell them you got it from me because the FBI might knock on my door. Surprise! Surprise shoreline. Woo, what a blessing. Definitely not my least favorite map of the entire game. Not at all. No, no. I like it early hardcore when you're doing stash runs, but uh, at any point after the first week, it's just literal. It's just hell. This place is just hell. Also, where am I? I'm, I'm in this. I'm lost. I'm in the source. Uh, oh, I'm over here. Okay. Fuck every time. Parkour. 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 Thank you. No. Yes. We're in. Okay. Okay. Oh, the bets. You're right. You, sir, speak the truths. Uh, pay the believers from the last one. We did survive. And start the bets for the next one. Will... Oh, did it run? Did it run? It says it's running. Yeah, there we go. Betting is open. You can bet. <laughs> that confusion emote might be quite possibly the best one I've added so far. Just with the amount of completely insane shit, I say. Also, this uh, shoreline key can probably get put over there. I don't know if East 213 has anything good in it. D-Cruncher will tell us shortly. D-Cruncher, anything good in uh, in shoreline East 213? O librarian? O librarian of the lexicon? I don't need the shampoo. Oh, hey. You're up. Uh, actually, hold on. Hold off on that. Let's slurp this first, because it does give energy recovery. Use the MRE when we're really running low. <laughs> the wrong bet. <laughs> oh, I did. I, I picked the wrong bet. Lol, that's funny. Okay, hold on, hold on. We're running it back. That's my bad. Cancel the bet, because it doesn't have the right payout. I'm sorry. And then we also just delete that, because that was a goof. That was a joke. Okay, the real bet is now running. Place them. Place them. But now is the time. Oh shit! An upgrade! 100% VSS? That's fun. Oh, that's too much fun for Tarkov though. How many bullets we got? Half? I can work with half. SP5 does a little work. Don't get it twisted. You can get a little twisted. But not like a contortionist twisted, you know? It's like 5%. Take that for the Salua. Armor? Armor? Armor! Um... Yeah. You know, I think I will. I will. Just for the memes. Probably gonna sell it, not gonna lie to you. It's very purple. Very purple armor. Oh, I should be taking tapes. You get an M1 botter. And that's just kind of fun. Did 
Sticks like a mule? It does. It does. Oh, whoops. Whoops. Said it got timed out. Sorry, buddy. Sorry, said it. Uh, everyone, hashtag justice for Senate in the chat, please. Hashtag free Senate. Look on that for a second. Hashtag justice for Senate. I can't believe you did a man that dirty. Cannot. You shame me. Shame me in my own home. I need, I want that for the barter. I don't care about that so much. I want the alkali to make more shampoos or more helmets. I must say, playing hardcore sucks ass in every conceivable way, but it does make you a lot better at game knowledge. Because like you're gonna have to learn everything. Got that going for it. Head eyes incoming. We're very blue. We're blue man at present. Blue man down. A titty. No. I refuse. On principle. <laughs> Send it to lend the ass. <laughs> oh, that's good. That was really good. What? Oh, read. Read. <laughs> Send it to lend the Oh, that's quality. Guys are so funny. I don't know how to pronounce your one rival, but I believe it. I believe it. Unless it's like he deserved it, in which case I I dis I suddenly disbelieve it. Do you give the juice? You give the you give you got the juice. You're like corn. Got the juice. Rip up that fish real quick. Alright, and let's get out of here. Go to lighthouse. Nothing good in the jackets. Unfortunately. Yeah, let's check the last one. Just check the last one. Another armor, I guess. Level 2. You be level 2, though. Am I kind of running around like there's no one on this map? You betcha. Do I feel regret? You bet not. Will I regret that feeling? You betcha. Slurping hot fish in an abandoned village, slowly becoming Mr. Tarkov. Oh god. Oh no, we've become everything we set out to destroy. Not to mention, hot fish from an old can. That's gonna be me real soon. I still have to do that MRE. I haven't eaten. It's sitting next to me. Decom discombobulated, but unconsumed. I'm terrified of it, to be honest. You're gonna be mad at me, but you're always mad at me. Give me this. Give me this. Give me that. We have a getter. And I have like a million bullets and extra magazines for this gun. <laughs> that he got every age like a fine wine. Yeah, it's definitely not improving its quality by refusing to eat it. We're decanting. We're aerating it. That's what we're doing. Oh, that's true. Room temperature fish is worse than hot fish. All right. Okay. Swear at me all you want. It, what? Everything you say bounces off to me and sticks to you because you're made of glue or whatever the, the prepubescent rhyming scheme is. I don't know what that means, but it's funny. We got any uh, Russians in chat? Can translate that for us? Also, Senate, are you out of prison yet? Have we hashtag freed Senate? Sorry, Senate. Mod abuse cannot stand. He must face trial. 
Hey, let's go to the. Oh, this is where I was going. Hey, okay, we're just gonna take a little walk up the. Go. Okay, cool. Let's go. Let's go straight for the road camp. I think next. Ah, oh, you joking? Just let me in. I'm right here. Just let me. In. <laughs> I can translate angry noises. That seems right. The cage of time is fickle in light of my eclipsing power. My God, he is the Senate. He is democracy. If anyone is interested, the scav is saying. Try to F me, good luck, because I will F you, you piece of S. That's right, we're family friendly on this channel. This is a Christian Minecraft server. Ain't none of that bad mouth potty talk in my world. Also, ain't none of that music in my world either, allegedly, it seems. I once got called gormless by an English professor. It was quite possibly the, the harshest burn I've ever received from someone who spends their day uh, critiquing poetry. I had a spoken word poetry phase in the early days of university because of course I did. There were three reasons. One, I actually quite like the art form, right? Two, uh, my ex ex girlfriend, who I hadn't, who I wasn't dating at the time yet, was a spoken word poet, and I was kind of hard on her. And three, there were about fifteen other incredibly attractive women with uh, incredibly polyamorous uh, worldviews who were also at those meetings. So, you know, it was like you get the art with the artist kind of situation. Um, I do wonder to this day if I am the subject of any uh, hate poems. But <laughs> All I'll say is if you're running through a dry spell right now, gentlemen, get involved in an autistic medium of some kind and go to group meetings because there will be many people there of the opposite sex or the same sex or whatever you're looking for who uh, probably feel the same way. Um, yeah, and even if you're bad, you're still there, you know, and that's what matters in the end. Okay, what was the music? You shall not return? Okay, fair Did I not pick 8 in the morning? Oh! <gasps> it's the Halloween thing. I think this means I'm tagged and cursed now? Get me into the mountains. It doesn't feel safe here. I can't see anything, chat. Oh god, it's the Halloween event. So, every 666,666 600, seconds, they turn off the lights in Tarkov. And it gets stormy. Oh. For heck, boys. I'm just- I'm running on instinct. Muscle memory. I don't know where I am. Okay, we're still on the mountain. It should be able to turn right at some point. Yes. He's moving on instinct. Oh, baby. Oh, this is scary. Yet more evidence that I was led through university by Little Miles. I'll have you know, uh, both Miles and Little Miles, uh, who's not that little, <laughs> you could ask the spoken word poets about that. Um, the, the, it was spelt with an I, like the distance. Bets? Oh, God, the bets. I, I wouldn't bet now if I was you, but hey, if you want to lose your money... Okay, yeah, we survived the shoreline inexplicably. It's the first time. Uh, will we survive Lighthouse? You tell me. Ooh, this is real spoopy. 100% <laughs> shocked. <laughs> oh, okay, we need to use- Okay, boys, tactical lightning. I want you all with your fingers on the print screen. You see that flash, you hit it, you tell me what's on screen, okay? Because I can't see. Tactical, tactical lightning. We're doing it. Arrive, I didn't see your message. Oh, and this was about the bets. Just remember, homie, before you spend your follicles, you gotta be here when the payout happens, so you don't get it. I don't think, anyway. I, to be honest, I, I don't really understand how the bets work, despite uh, the game and me and everyone explaining it to me about a hundred times. We got a grizzly. Kind of fun. They're like whispering. I don't know why. I'm so scared. This is some hella spooky shit. Okay. Oh, tactical lightning. Oh my god. That is this. This is ambience, dude. This is the ambiance that you pay for when you go to Guy Fieri's uh, road roadside kitchen oyster roux. Let me tell you. What's a hoisteroo, you ask? I don't know. The language failed me once more. Hi! 
Hi ya! Hi ya! We only need, we actually have the lion we need, so kind of indifferent about losing this. We should probably just leave the raid. Um, this is not great content, but it's also kind of great content. Do we leave the raid? Yes or no, boys? Tell me. Particular 8 o'clock, 200 meters and closing fast. Oh god. I need another tactical lightning bolt, please. Uh, I actually saw something. There. You see it? There. Okay, remember we're tagged and cursed. They'll be coming. They'll be coming round the mountain when they come, when they come. Show your fucking light again. I dare you, fucker. Remember, we're tagged and cursed. We get close, they storm us. Slow. Make it tactical. Did we get a grenade? No, we got this trash. Give me a grenade. Who could play at this game? play at this game. Well, that's very cinematic, isn't it? Ooh. Get slow. It's smart. I feel like whispering, I don't know why. So spooky. So I feel like this light should go further. What's happening? Alive? What's happening? I press console. That's my secret. I'm always alive. I press the tell button instead of... Uh, I don't know what I was trying to press. W? I fat fingered? I don't want this. Any goodies for me in here? is actually making it harder to see. Oh, they changed the color of the lights too? That's cool. I like that a lot. <laughs> Alright, that was fun. That's pretty sick. Oh, I love this, man. It's so dark. Oh, this is proper spooky, boys. It's right spooking me. the wireless transmitter done with your shenanigans game i do need that I do, I do need the second vase i don't think they've heard of second vase pippin what is that elite pliers we got plenty watch we need one more for like a sick barter trade the chat will mock me and call me names and point at my tummy and say i'm fat Boys, I'm laser focused right now. L1 injector. Sleep. I'm not that sleepy. We have turned in the one we need for samples, though. Don't uh, don't forget that.
There was a, a, re, a re, what's on the cyclone battery on there, which we should definitely pick up. Max. Do you actually give energy? Yes, you do. But I think we'll slop this down first. What does slop mean? I'm not sure. Don't ask questions, okay? You know how this you know how this whole operation works. Steal his headlight. Steal his head to light your way. Oh, uh, that would actually hold on. On the way out. I will take out a pumpkin on the way out. We'll, we'll make space. I might have to drop the lion to do it. Oh no, maybe not anymore. This gives us a few extra slots. Yeah, if we can find a better rig. Actually, chat. What rig did he have? If I miss something critical, I don't need that 870 barrel. No, I have I have the long 870. I don't need the 870. There's another. You notice how that scab made no noise? The one that came after me anyway. There was no audio cue. He didn't shout. It was just there. Oh, it wasn't a cyclone battery. It was a pack of bad ammunition. Suddenly feel like I've lost a lot less. <whistles> Spooky game. Spooky game, boys. Beard tips or not bald one? What would I recommend for a beard? If you're gonna try and grow a beard, um, my mo my biggest advice to you is the, the the old advice of shave it often to grow it is nonsense. It doesn't actually make a difference. The best thing you can do to grow your beard in a healthy way is to moisturize your skin um, every day after you shower, especially if you use soap on your face and if you can get a face scrub. Uh, really clear out the pores. It helps the hairs get through. Um, try your best to. If you can, try your best to get a good night's sleep every night. Um, it just helps your skin heal. And then again, the pores are more healthy, they're more likely to grow. A lot of stuff in that sort of vein. Just good skin care leads to good hair growth. Um, especially on facial hair. So don't undervalue the, the value of a good routine. For me, all I do is I just ex I exfoliate twice a week uh, with just like a hand scourer. Um, and then I... Got a GP coin and a VPX, but not the radio. Damn. This. Money. Where's the GP coin? Oh, I love that they changed the light, the color grading on the lights. That is, it's a very cool detail. I think it looks so good. There's one spawn here we can look at. Got a military tube. I don't think I need that, but I'm kind of running out of stuff to drop. I guess that for now. Another spawn. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Nothing. All right. Well, I mean, that was pretty. That was pretty spooky, but we did make it out. When she says turn out the lights, but you realize she means in talk off. <laughs> That's really good. Oh, I hate that I laughed at that. Oh, God, that's great. Yell Shock is actually an insanely good stock. Um, what am I willing to drop for it? Do I have to drop something? Okay, well, first, tell, do we have a better rig for me? Do you have a military thing for me? Uh, the, the radio for me, maybe? Got a packer. Do not want to pack a 30 millimeter rifle scope. I've got too many 30 millimeter rifle scopes as it is, my man. Drop that. I don't want to drop this. Okay, I think we're going to just leave it. May come to regret that later. Don't really care about anything in toolboxes right now. Let's check these guys and we'll get up. Sleep? Absolutely not. Fair enough. Fair enough. I didn't. I didn't consider that argument. Thermometer. We don't really need. Need 
pressure valves. Oh, okay, that's our daily done. Oh, this is a MP9. Um, okay, what does 14 rounds of PST mean to me? I think it means one bandage. I think it means one bandage. We have so many of those double use ones. We do need the small ones to make the double ones, but we don't have the vodka yet, so that's still a while off. Other beard tips? Uh, try not to rub your face too much. I'm really guilty of this. Because you end up pulling out hairs, and that damages the pore, and it makes it less likely to grow another healthy hair afterwards. Uh, I'm really guilty of that myself. What else? When you do, um, when you do go to shower, I think I think probably the best one is just keep your skin hydrated. Because using bar soap on your skin is really bad for it, uh, and using anything with um, sulfur in it is really bad for it. So if you can, try and try and find like either a, a face scrub that you feel doesn't leave you feeling too dry afterwards. It's up to each person. Or or get yourself some nice face cream. And moisturize your hands too, guys. Uh, and take care of your nails. I know this is like, kind of like, uh, what are you talking about, streamer? But just, you know, this one, this one's for the ladies. Um, you're doing everyone in the world a favor if you just kind of practice some basic, uh, you know, self-care hygiene, whatnot. Uh, I promise you, your significant other, uh, or lack thereof, will appreciate it. Okay, now do we go back for anything? Uh, you know what? We do take a shrimp mag, though, because I do have a bunch of shrimp barters. Grab that. We do be shrimping. I heard footsteps near the water. I'm a little... a little sus. Okay, full order. Oh, we got about half a mag of PSM. -er. I realize you guys can't see it, so I just read it out. Oof. I, I can't see dawn. It, it's it's like ten o'clock in the morning right now, guys. I, I picked a morning time slot. It, I think it was it was eight thirty when we uh, when we logged on, and uh, they switched off the lights. This is the part of the Halloween event because it is dark. There's a timer. I think it's on their website. I'm not actually sure where you find it. But there is a timer that counts up to 666,666. And then when it hits that number, then they turn off the lights in Tarkov. So if you can, you can predict it. And this is when all the spooky stuff happens. I'm a little heavy. ADS is quite slow. It is nice to have a gun that shoots the 7.62 caliber because we've got a lot of PS ammo, and you know what? Even late game PS ammo is good enough. It's probably the best. This late of the of the bads, you know, best of the bads. Okay, let's check the jackets and reset. All right, unfortunately, we did not get the uh, did not get the any more kill. We did get another chalet kill, I guess. Although I don't know if that counted. I had five. It did count. Cool, 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 cool. cool. PS ammo. Oh, the kvass. That's great. That's actually a pretty useful tool this this, this time of the year. I don't want to drop. I mean, I don't need them. They're just money. They're just money. There are there are some oh, there's some really good barter trades, so, but they're not that hard to get either. Ah, I'm leaving. I don't like this. I don't. These are hard choices. I need more. I need to bring a bigger bag, man. EPT. Okay, jackets, and then we're out. Oh, did they change the dustbin? No, it's just spooky. It's just a spooky bar. Okay, we got the those the clippers. When you find out the sun is a light controlled by a switch. Dude, so true. So true. Oyuri, that does give us level 5 armor. This game is really pulling, not pulling the punches today. I'm going to leave it behind. I'm going to leave it behind. Chat. That was pumpkin light. You saw it. Get me 
lightning out of here. Maybe it was just lightning. My night factory rat waves have been seriously stymied by this event. I believe that, Alan. I believe that entirely. I'm very keen to get Tarkov Hardcore finished so that we can play Tarkov Unlocked. I think it's going to be so sick. I will post the updated rules uh, later this evening or tomorrow. We won't be streaming tomorrow, by the way, guys. Um, I'm going to be working and slash editing all morning, and then I'll be, I'm going to a house party. And then on Sunday, I will either be hungover or live. Uh, or both. We'll see. Oh, yeah, this is the weekly to find. Uh, we need four more. Do we need, do we need the water filters still? I think, we ha I think we have the water filters, right? We just need Aquamaris. I, I don't know if we'll finish this one, I'll be honest. If I were to replace this, it cost me a lot of money. But let's see what, okay, let's see what else we can get. I don't really need it with Skier. Still 30 PMCs, I can't do that. Okay, we've spent 300,000 rubles. Okay, suddenly the scab junk box seems a little further away. Okay, find four sling backpacks, four bomber beanies, and five GP7 gas masks. This, oh, and we get a gazelle. This seems more, and two tank batteries. Okay, hold on. What does a takedown sling backpack? Takedown. Raiders. We have to kill raiders for that. So let's just check that again. So that was, this is possible. Bomber beanie. That's, uh, scavs can spawn with it. And GP7 sca gas masks. So scavs and stashes for both of these. This is raiders. That's the only way we're going to get that. Uh, but YouTube, that's going to be the end of it for this episode. I will see you all in the next one. Stream, don't go anywhere. We're not done. Cheers. And of course, a huge thank you to our channel members and patrons for this month. You guys rock. Kelly Ananas, Call Me Bo82, Old Man Tater, Sir Tristan H, Knee Cruncher, Riley David, The Senate, Richard Berry, Sleep Deprived Sam, Arrivo, Charlie Weber, Mermix, Officer C4, Not K Author, Rob, Adichi Fanboy, Adachi Fanboy? LCG Canyon Sahar, Dread Not Us, Jack Smallman, Cut Beef Go Ham, Jan the Pan, Preth and Parush, Ragnar, Skull Crew, I'm Alpha, you damn right I'm not. Badass Beast, DePoyo44, Killy Thousand, Raija, Mr. King, Cairo, and Couch Potato. Thank you all very much.